morning everyone today i would like to draw your attention to acts chapter 3 verses 2 to 10 here we see that a man is begging for money he has been crippled all his life and his friends would bring him every day to the temple gate and keep him outside the temple area to beg he sees peter and john coming to the temple area and he asks for the money but instead they say that we have no gold no silver to give but by the power of jesus christ of nazareth stand up and walk many of us i know have been stuck outside the gate being in that crippled situation for a long long time you are stuck so long that you know not what you got to do you cannot think of getting ahead and you might just want advices or consolation now to sympathize you for where you are and now you have limited yourself so much that you have lowered your expectation that man identified himself just as beggar and expected no greater reward from the apostles other than money we might also have limited our mindset that we want an ordinary prescription for a long treatment you just want a temporary relief but not a long term healing maybe you are so frustrated that it has become a pattern for you the beggar had the pattern of begging so he asked for money he was doing and stuck in that situation for so long he dare not thought of a shift or say his expectation of getting something new in his life almost died but i am here to tell you today get up walk walk out of paralysis that you are being held now walk out of your paralysis that is holding you now for so long once you tell your mind and take up the action god will use your knee and the ankle that were not functioning will start functioning now why are you outside the gate that is so beautiful is the paralysis keeping you out from entering into the temple area once you come out of it you'll en- enter inside and you'll discover the beauty of life so stand up and walk don't make calculation speculation or reason on how should i walk as i have not walked all my life and i have been crippled just throw away those crutches just throw away the crutches of your logic and walk walk by faith and know that the one who carries you is worthy to catch you even when you fall just you need to do is to take a step of faith even in the uncertainties even when everything seems dark just take a leap of faith and see how the red sea will be parted before you i believe that this word will bless bless you and it will encourage you and god will speak it what you need to do next he'll speak to you today